He said he gon' stop, nigga, do that Play with your life, you gon' lose that Throwing them shots, you don't shoot back Where's your gun, where your tools at? Switch it, switch it, switch it up Niggas bitchin', bitchin' up Got the Fendi just because Bogo Lenties for the run Demon shootin' just for fun Niggas ain't dumb What's good, guys? Nick Nasty here for another video And today, this one is about my likes and dislikes on my 350Z and you know she's looking good right now she's looking good look at the back and we just put the black badges on The plastic bumper. <laughs> yeah, that just that's crazy. Man. That one actually went on way better. For real. Yeah. That's that was clean. For real. Looking real good. Uh, don't mind that sign right there. This is the construction view. But yeah, I'm gonna just be going over what I do like, what I don't like. You know, there's a lot of likes, but there's also, you know, kind of a lot of dislikes. But you know, I love my baby and nothing's gonna change, of course. As you can see over time, we did add some new things. We got the black door handles. Right now we got a nice little carbon fiber diffuser. Black badges right now. But you know, just a little thing. But now to begin with the video, I'm gonna start off with the likes. So, what I do like about my 350Z is that, you know, this is a timeless car. Like, years will go by and people will still love this car. That's the thing. And, you know, I'm gonna always love this car. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm always love this car for sure. You know, it just looks beautiful. And it's just gonna keep looking better. My first like honestly should have been that the car is manual. And that is the biggest like. I don't knock automatics, you know, like, you know, they're faster, you know, you gotta like them. But I just like manual in almost every car. And that's just me, you know, other people might feel the same, other people might dislike, but that's just what it is. So another like, it's a coupe. I have no back seats. So no, you can't bring your friends. No, your grandma can't sit in the back. None of that, okay? I got one other seat. And usually the most amount of people I have in the car is like two other people. So I mean, that's chilling. Another like is the aftermarket support. There are so many aftermarket parts for this car. It's unbelievable, like it's, honestly crazy like you could have the whole car carbon fiber if you want you could have it anything like there's so many parts and that's what i like i'm about to you know go crazy or i'm gonna try because i'm balling on a budget to be honest and i know most of y'all feel me out there and this spot may look a little familiar you know i did my little muffler delete video here and that was pretty good but i think it might be time for an exhaust to be honest but i'm thinking single exit who knows? Hey, man, you to sound nice. Yo! <laughs> you know, you had to show off that that John sounded mad nice. Another like is my car was babied, to be honest. It was basically garage kept by some old man in Pennsylvania with, you know, the nice smooth roads. 
And this John just sat in the garage. You know, he took it out for a while. This is a little baby, but he upgraded to a little 5.0. That John's mad nice. It's like baby blue, manual. John's tough. So he definitely upgraded from a Z. But you know, I love the Z. I do love the Z. She looks mad nice. My suspension and I get so many questions on if I'm on coils or springs or whatever. No, I'm on stock height. It does look nice though. I won't lie. You know, I do want to get that fixed in the future. Probably going to go on springs. I don't know. We might see. Because I do like the low look. It does look better. I don't know. I mean, it's already low, but I think I like it a little bit lower, to be honest. I'm not trying to be on a stance life type time because I like going fast, you feel me? So I can't do that. I also like how loud the Z's are. They just sound so nice to me. Probably not a lot of other people like the sound of a Z, but I like the sound. And it just sounds beautiful. Like, probably not full on trumpet noise, but I like the sound. You know, like it sounds good. It's loud, but not too loud. And if you go straight pipe, it might just be a little too loud. That's just my opinion. And now on to the dislikes. So I'm gonna start off with the paint. See, the car was kept in good condition, but you know, over time, the sun does mess up the paint a little bit. You know, you get the sunspots here and there. I'm glad I don't have any rust, but I do have some sunspots and I'll show y'all in just a second. As you can see right here, it's like not, too bad but, you know like on the top of course that's where it's gonna be worse i am thinking about you know either like doing some carbon fiber on the top or just wrapping it i don't know just whatever will make it look better but overall the paint around it does look good another dislike would be the sensors and problems on these cars only because they're just pretty old and you know some people don't really switch out sensors or take care of things like those so sometimes if you get the car then you might be the one stuck with all those problems and you know after that then things should be straight but then you know after a while another thing might go and it's you know just a little repetitive but sometimes people change out everything beforehand you know so you don't have to deal with that later on but you know I'm just doing it as it goes and I know what y'all are thinking. No, my oil consumption is not bad. People always say Z's consume the most oil and it, you know, it's just bad and all that, but mine is perfectly fine. I've changed it like once or twice ever since I've had her and it's almost been a year. I know that sounds crazy, but like my oil is perfect. I don't know what it is, but it's crazy. Other people I know, they'll change their oil like probably once a month or once every two months like that's just how it is and I don't know how but you know every car is different to be honest other dislike is that my driver's side window motor did go out and that honestly sucks because you know whenever I pass a car guy you know I can't even stick my hand out the window or nothing and I can't even feel the breeze nothing I just got my passenger window and that doesn't really do nothing Look at that, John. Doesn't work. Other dislike is that the door handles do go on the cars. My driver's side door handle went, and for a while I was using the window to go in and whatever, using the passenger side to get in, do all that. But then I already decided that I was getting black door handles, but then, you know, it just went out, so it was just perfect timing for it. So did that. I might get the carbon fiber covers for that. Need some carbon fiber here too. Just carbon fiber all over. Ooh, and the gas, especially if you drive like me, the gas is just, mm, it's not good. I pay over $50 to fill up a tank now, and that's crazy. I shouldn't even wait for it to get that low. I, why? 
what am I doing? What am I doing? The gas, like, it's just crazy. That's a big dislike to me. I don't know. I just consume all gas. Like, if it's not the oil for me, it's definitely the gas. I wouldn't say I have too many dislikes, but my last dislike about my car is my sound system because it's real good you know stock it came with bulls but it just be gone sometimes that bass it be bumping too hard and then it just stops and i'm just listening to music without bass and like that john's trash so i mean it's an old car so i understand probably fix something about it you know gotta get a new radio that john's pretty poop and that's just basically it like i wish it was really up to date but you know, this car came out like 2004, so you know, it, it is what it is. But that's really it for my dislikes. And I'm getting a lot of looks as people drive by. I guess they like the whip. But with that said, YouTube, I'll catch y'all later. Peace.